I'm going to show you how to log into YouTube Music Deleter using browser authentication. You'll be copying some information from your browser and pasting it into the login window in the app. It's a bit easier if you use Firefox for this, but I'll show you how to do it with Chrome too. First, go to music.youtube.com and log in to the account you want to use. Then open up the Web Developer Tools. You can do that in most browsers by either hitting F12 or Control shift i I recommend dragging it to the left to expand it and make it bigger, or clicking the three-dot button to dock it to the bottom to make it easier to see. Click on the tab labeled Network. Then type the word Browse into the filter bar. After you do that, you may already see some request entries in the table already, but either way, click on any button in YouTube Music like Explore, for example. Now you should see a request entry named Browse show up in the table. It should have a size that is greater than 0 bytes. If it says 0 bytes, then click on another button to make another entry appear. Once you have a row that looks good, you're going to copy the request headers from it. If you're using Firefox, all you have to do is right-click it, select Copy Value, and then Copy Request Headers, and then paste the result into the YouTube Music Deleter window and you're done. If you're using Chrome or a Chromium-based browser like Edge or Brave, then there is no Copy Request Headers button, so you have to copy the request headers by hand. Click on the request entry named Browse, and a new panel will appear. In the Headers tab, scroll down to the section labeled Request Headers. If it says Provisional Headers are shown like you see here, then you will have to check this Disable Cache box, and then refresh the page and click on another button in YouTube Music to make a new browse entry appear, and click on it again and return to the Request Headers section. Now that all your headers are shown, you're going to select everything from the Accept header all the way down to the very bottom of the Request Headers section. And that is what you will copy and paste into the YouTube Music Deleter sign-in window. If you get any error that some entries were missing from your headers, then be sure you followed the above instructions carefully. You maybe didn't copy all the necessary request headers, or you clicked on a request entry that didn't have the right headers either because you're not signed in, you clicked on an entry that wasn't named Browse, or you clicked on an entry that had a size of zero bytes. Give it another try. And if you're still having trouble, then leave a comment or reach out to me on Discord. I'm sorry the login process is kinda annoying now, you used to be able to log in with Google integration, but Google decided to remove OAuth capabilities in November 2024. If it gets added back, I will immediately update the app to use it instead, since it was a lot simpler. If you have any issues with YouTube Music Deleter itself, you can reach out to me on Discord or open an issue on GitHub if it's not working right.